lays that one back to Jimmy Moore to uh, kick us off towards Rowney, but uh, quite a way out. He uh, dips it towards the back post and uh, danger averted, Matthew. Think of a card, free kick's taken quickly, Gilboy. Played that inside to Holt with a great ball back to Matty Williams on the near side. Williams with a ball towards the back stick. Chippendale there and uh, deflected wide for a very corner, Matthew. Sports, you can hear uh, commentary of Radcliffe uh, against Buxton. That's still nil-nil in the company of uh, Joe Heaton and Steve Wellington. And the shot comes in there from uh, Leon Creech. But... Uh, it's, uh, Given Berry a free kick, taken quickly. Gilboy steaming through the Darwin defence. He's come central. Looks to take the shot with his left foot, but that's deflected wide. Off, uh, off Ben Wharton for a goal kick. Rio Wilson Hayes uh, with a ball towards the back stick, and that's uh, nipped in at the back post by uh, Nathan Bond. Something and nothing there. Throw into Taken. Rowney. Moore. Williams on the right hand side. Ball across towards the back stick. But uh, Stefan Holden does well. One hand raised from Chippendale into the penalty area. That's uh, up for a, a second header. Ayo Ibrahim on the end of it. That goes wide. Ball comes in, Ben Wharton there, oh, and just wide. Great free kick. He's done so far as being scuffed um, towards us and um, it's, um, giving Berry chances every time when Darwin think they win, uh, won back a bit of possession. Then. Chippendale with his left foot. He looks to have a shot on goal and it uh, is wide to Jake Kenny on the far side. Wharton. Wharton takes the shot and that is wide. The uh, referee has pulled over the captain for Darwin, Ben Langford and the goalkeeper Stefan Holden. I presume this is about uh, time wasting. Yeah, but if you're not going to book the keeper, this is just wasting more time, it feels. Rio Wilson Hayes putting the pressure on for the home side. John O'Hunt slips. A shot comes in from Wilson Hayes, and that's saved by uh, Jack Atkinson. Back towards Ibrahim. And Ibrahim, lack of control there and probably lack of awareness. And Rio Wilson Hayes is looking to turn Jack Atkinson and he's in. And Darwin have doubled their lead. And Jack Atkinson in frustration boots the ball out of the ground. Poor defending there, Matthew Holmes. Yeah, from the player I was complimenting only about 10 minutes ago. And um, onto the record, but we haven't been able to do anything near that so far. Buxton, they've doubled their lead at Radcliffe. Ball into the penalty area. Towards the back stick! Oh, and he's cleared off the line! <laughs> Chippendale with the ball across. That's headed away. Second shot comes in from Holton. Saved well by Stefan Holden. He's the target man, and his cross was rubbish in the end, and it's caused Darwin to break. And they're taking the shot and Atkinson saves at point blank range to deny Creech. And, uh, might make the half time team talk slightly easier as Gilboy is there and Holt takes the shot and that one is into the car park. And at half time, Matthew Holmes, uh, Berry going 2 0 down.
and the quality of Tom Greaves. You're going to go for it in this position. And if he gets the two goals to get us level, we, he gets that uh, milestone and already on the tack straight away, Barry, in this second half. And an indication of the way they're going to play. That hum has uh, made a reappearance. As uh, Gilboy is into the penalty area, laced that back to Ben Watson. There's a goal. And two minutes into the second half, a great ball back from Lewis Gilboy to Ben Watson, and Ben Watson does what Ben Watson does. He's with Lewis Gilboy on the right hand side. And again, where the goal came from was getting it out wide, and Darwin haven't been able to. Dude. Chris Holt's there again, and that's just wide. We've seen quite a few shots from Chris Holt in the, the first half, and that's his, his first of the second. <laughs> that, is the, uh, that is the case. Berry in possession. Wharton lays that off to Chris Holt. Chris Holt's on the edge of the area. Left foot is shot! And it's 2-2! Two -two. And the, uh, the Berry fans go absolutely crazy on the, uh, the far corner, and... Uh, Six minutes into the second half. As uh, Berry in the ascendancy. Lewis Gilboy, and he's uh, fouled late there by uh, by Lynch. Only his second appearance in a Darwin shirt, Chris Lynch, to take. Chippendale with the left foot, and it is uh, wide off the... Uh, off the side of the uh, hoarding and uh, got a great opportunity to add to his ledger. It's, uh, Chris Holt in possession now. He's laid that off to Chippendale. Chippendale with a shot. Ben Watson! And that's 3 2. And 10 minutes into the second half, Barry have turned it round. And again, it was so easy for Barry there. Chippendale did, um, he just did brilliantly to um, get on to the end of the ball. It looked like the pass might have been just over here. He kept the thing, played it across, it evaded all the defenders. And Wharton had an easy tapping. And I don't want to say I want to take credit for this, but I did tell Wharton to get more into the game and now he's got two goals to his name. Hard hit the face with going two goals down, going... Wilson Hayes has laid that one off and takes a shot, comes in from uh, Clayton Gorman. It was a brilliant block from Hunt there. Has run through um, this afternoon. I think it's about eight goals they've conceded um, in that period. Ben Wharton, twist with a shot on, oh, it's off the post. He was wheeling away in celebration there before. And heading hands moment there. Brilliant play again, twisted and turned and managed to get the shot away. And that one we've still got uh, <laughs> 20 minutes, 25 minutes of uh, of this game in front of us. Ball forward towards Tom Greaves. Greaves has led that off. Thomas Soto who takes the shot, that's saved. Steve Hoy uh, got the goal for Ramy a bit earlier on. As Gilboy turns his man, that uh, comes into the box, Holt. Back towards Williams and that's... Uh, Crossed into the box and uh, over the bar. The ball is over the top towards Tom Greaves. Can he finish it off? He can! Through the legs of the keeper. And that is goal 299 for Tom Greaves. Matthew Holmes. And we've spoken about it so often in this game. The ball over the top, Darwin have mainly dealt with it well so far, but that completely misjudged. I think the fans straight away knew that um, the defender was in trouble weighing that ball and was soaring over his head and Greaves uh, didn't look panicked, slotted it on through the legs of the keeper underneath him and all the marks of a man who's on the verge of getting 300 career goals. Um, no panic whatsoever, fell to the perfect man for Berry and after being 2-0 down after the first half, it's now 4-2 to the away side. He's laid that off to Langford. End whistle. Ball in. Header comes in off the bar for Bond. And he'll be just as frustrated as his teammates that he hasn't been able to do anything. Brazil now takes the shot from distance. Palms it off to Greaves. And that's... Uh, 
That's saved. Gilboy. Brazil takes the shot. And that's a fifth for Berry. Harry Brazil from the bench. From around 10 yards out. It's from 2-0 uh, down, Matthew Berry lead 5-2. Yeah, Matt Berry was like four chances all in one where Brazil... Berry in possession, Gilboy. He's turned two defenders, shot comes in and that's uh, over the bar, over the stand and on the M65, Matthew. And the referee has uh, blown the uh, full-time whistle. And uh, Matthew Holmes, after a, a five, after a 2-0 down at the break, very uh, turn this round uh, and win 5-2. And all that talk of the AstroTurf hasn't really affected how they play today, Barry. Andy Welsh um, geeing up the fans, uh, bigging up, I think he's bigging up Chris Holt though, who's had an influential performance. I think him and Gilboy would be the standouts of the match, and I think Holt will probably take the man of the match accolades, I reckon. Yeah, 100% into uh, to stoppage time uh, in the game between uh, Radcliffe and Buxton, and Buxton have taken the lead. <laughs>